Good evening, everyone. I hope we're all doing well. Anyone who's joining me live or watching the VOD later. Just having a look for a server, and I'll let you know what it is when I pick one. Don't think there's any all map servers available at the moment, so it's likely going to be. I'm leaning towards the airport. If anyone is here and is wanting to play already, do feel free to say in chat if you'd rather. Airport or Danger Hills? But I'm leaning towards airport. Otherwise, it's the command and control game mode, which is so cheesable. I think we'll hop in the airport game and then hopefully at some point catch a all map server. Let me grab the invite code. Let's get in chat for anyone who would like to join. Eugen37, airport 10v10. I'm going to switch to Pact because I want to play my deck that I built for the 6th. My little air assault deck, which I imagine is going to go badly, but we will we'll give it a go. Game has filled up. That was quick. Sorry if anyone didn't get in. No one mentioned that we were joining, so hopefully no one's missed out. Now we're having the usual people leaving and joining at the end. Filling me with confidence that one of the players on my team is called I Suck at This Video Game. A little bit concerned about that. Especially when I'm trying something weird and wonderful with a deck. I tried a deck earlier that I built with War Yes's um, deck builder on their website. Uh, it's an absolutely horrendous deck, but I did surprisingly well with it. Second best on my team. Um, even though it's a horrendous deck, which just goes to show how badly my team did. More than anything else, perhaps. But uh, that was good fun. I might actually... its It makes horrendous decks, but I might actually have to build another one just for the fun of it. Because it was quite entertaining. This is the deck that I put up on my RTS Cast and Stuff channel yesterday. It is focused on some sort of air assault. Uh, and I guess we've got to go whole hog and go into Lee in it, haven't we? So this is going to be... You know, I'm just putting down all the expensive stuff. Um, Jaeger, Jaeger Metis. My anti-air... My, my only issue is here, I don't have any anti-air. I'm going to have to take the escort me. I am now out of point. <laughs> so I've got... Can I take a command, actually? Oh, they're expensive. I can't take one. I'm going to have to ditch something. Let's ditch a Jaeger and let's take the command. This is going to end horribly. I'm going to lose all of these units. But I'm going to try it anyway. The other point to go for would be this one. If there's no forward deployment player there, you can get into Constantine pretty easily. But I think this is just going to be an easy one. Get in this side and hold it. I've got... Uh, these guys have anti-air weaponry. The uh, R-60 missiles. So the aim is to get those up there to help defend against any aircraft and stuff i'm just going to make the chat very small because uh <laughs> people might get angry when i do this uh metis obviously decent squads and these are all rocket attack choppers hence they're so expensive but uh i could even buy a cheap plane one of these horrendous bombers
we go all in with this. Oh, you know what I could have done? Got 19 seconds. I'd rather have the feather. Thank you for resubscribing. Nine months. It's almost an entire year. Really weird to think it's that long. Feather might even have. Feather may not be there. That might just be on. Uh, that might be on repeat. Oh, he is there. There he is. I am trying my air assault build. It's very expensive, might I say. But they're coming over and then we're going to unload them when they get there. And the escort knees are going to Q move that way. <clears throat> I'm expecting this to go really badly. I will say that much. Um, I guess I should call in a tank or something next. <laughs> oh yeah, here we go. So we're against someone who is also... Uh, got forward deploy. It's alright, because they're not going to be expecting what's about to happen. The escort me will deal with these as they get in there. See, the Escortes are engaging now. They know I'm coming, though, so this is bad for me. <laughs> we'll engage on these. There's loads of uh, AA stuff down here. Unload, 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 unload. Yeah. This was always going to be rough. Unload, 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 unload. Yeah, there's multiple players here, so... There's like three players here. When have there ever been three players at this point? There have never been three players at that point. What the fuck? I told you I was going to lose everything. took the point though but yeah there's like there's like three or four players there i mean what so they've got no one in the middle of the map basically they all came to meet me oh well there you go <laughs> the the end of the air assault deck <laughs> very quick but i still have that point capped ah, i'll take it back now Mm. It was kind of funny. Yeah, I, I'm un. How, how could there possibly? Never ever have I seen three people go to that point. Never. The amount of times I played this map, that has never happened before. I am baffled. Normally people go for the middle, and then one or two people go there, but three. I'm just going to take the middle of the map then. I think we uh, go with some cheaper stuff, though. Did a bit of damage. Definitely didn't kill as much as I lost. No way. No way. How are we not annihilating the middle? No one's even capped Ivan. What are you doing, team? Oh, my God. I know I threw away all my units, but come on, team. You haven't even capped Ivan. They're going to have stuff in that point before I get there. Can I just say, by the way, Level in this game means nothing. 
because two games I've played today where my team has appeared to have the higher level of the two teams. And the last game, my team failed hard, and this one is not looking good either, to be honest. Who's leaving? Is that... Weirdly, the other team. Loads of the other team are leaving. Which... I would have said they're not doing that badly, other than they're getting bogged down in the forest there. Let me get these guys unloaded here. Oh, before that Roland 3 arrives, please. Unload, unload, unload. Get down. There we go. My point. Although that uh, Leo 203 is kind of scary. I can kill that, though. I don't care if this jet dies. I just want to kill that tank. Before it kills my command. Bring in this silly napalm bomber as well, which is gonna. I'm gonna have it fire here. And flame grill the road. Just need to take the point. Hey, Style. Goodbye, Jet. It's alright, I forgive you. I guess I could dive bomb. Uh, this is going to be awkward. Fine, I'm just going to. Is this the, this is the AI anyway? I'm just going to bomb that road. Can we bomb those? Actually, just yeah, do it. <laughs> it dies in one hit. I don't know why I tried to be honest. It's such a shit check. <laughs> Uh, time for the T-64s. Do you have anything long range? I have a couple of conkers. Let's do that. And some recon. I haven't got any recon up here. It's coming in the chopper. Oh, well, that's fine. I'll just uh, tell it to come in a bit further back. My land's coming in this side. Well, this guy's pushing up now, actually, so maybe I can reroute these guys this way. You're going to get into the... You're going to come this way. Where are these guys going? Oh, that's the AI. That's why it's doing that. You missed my epic fail of an opener style. I'm trying my deck build that I did the other day on the RTS Cast and Stuff channel, the uh, Air Assault one. Three people went to Leonid. Have you ever known three people go to Leonid? Ever. I feel like I got robbed. Did I call in a Conkers? If I didn't, I am now. Of Clara. Ooh. Oh, that's logistics. That's okay. So there's Air Maxes there. I need my tank in then. Just thinking, how am I going to kill those things? Are oh, these guys going to help? The oh, nice. MI24P helps a lot. Not unload him in the middle of the runway. Bring in another T-64. Oh, they're pushing us. That's good, though. Kind of... I kind of want them to push, really. Because then they get close to my infantry. A little bit closer. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Run away, run away. <laughs> now you can be seen. I think we're okay here. 
you're looking a bit worse for wear, but... Honkers, wrong place, wrong time. There's my tank, get over here. This uh, MI24 is saving our bacon right now. AMX-10P is slaughtering everything though. I hate AMX-10s. It's the AMX-10RC even. Nice artillery support. Appreciating that. Uh, no. <laughs> I was gonna... I wanted some supply, but that would be overkill. You are going to deploy in that. Oh, hang on. Come up that way. That's going a really weird way. Surely it's quicker to go up this road, then cross the little bit of grass, and then continue up the road. What is that? I don't know. Bad Milan. Alright. I can probably bring in a book back here now, and a supply vehicle for it. get this conkers in there this one will get in here and then get repaired Will I salvage my horrible opener maybe yeah I probably should have I, I just I could have done the helo opener on Constantine I probably would have succeeded I just figured that's where most people would go. I was not expecting three people on that side of the map. That's just weird. I played this map plenty and never seen that before. Most of their teams left in the first three minutes of the game, so at least it's going to be a quick one. But I have lost a lot of shit. What artillery did I bring? I do have the... Oh, I've got this thing that fires really fast. That's so expensive, though. Leo 2F4. I really want to bring this in. Conkers, getting some kills. Yeah. Uh, what? That's an impressive s survival on that Jaguar. I'll give it that. I'm actually quite impressed with that. What's the line of sight on that thing? Not good enough. Good. It's BV over here. Come on, get the get the command vehicle. Come on, come on. Yeah. When that conquers is fixed, I'm going to move it into here because I'm hoping it can kill that leopard. In fact. Oh. Where's my RT? There we go. I'm going to try and hit the Leo with RT and then also hit it with the Conkers. This is my grand plan. Oh, it's moving. My grand plan might not work. It's the AI controlling it anyway, to be fair. Oh, we're firing. What are we firing at? Come on, side shot. Ah, worth a try. Pull this back here for a minute. Push that up. My artillery, control group one, and then we are going to. Let's whack that. That was a seed jet, but it didn't come far enough across. Bombed that area, I think, but thankfully didn't get us. I'm just going to move this up slightly. They've moved that command vehicle, haven't they? I can't see it anymore. Oh. 
Fair enough, let's just move over. Oh, like, I killed I killed the Milan too with the artillery, <laughs> unintentionally. Uh, when they've moved a bit, I'll attack that instead. You can unload here, you're going to go into there, you're going to push up, you're going to get across here. What of Clara can push up to there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <coughs> It's the AI pushing you around again. Come on, side shot. Oh, that was beautiful. Conker's got a side shot on it. That'll never happen again. That was incredibly satisfying. The RNG was on my side. The urn... Is that the other helicopter? The, because it's only got four health. So it's a one hit kill. That's why I didn't take it. <laughs> I'm not a fan of the whole one hit kill aspect of that one. Probably we can kill that thing. Once I finish firing, it can go over there. Oh, do they, please, please, please! I want these shells to land as that command gets there. Come on, come on, yes, come on, double kill. Come on, no, <laughs> damn it. Oh well, the conkers might get the kill. Mine are the opponent, or the allies, I should say. Let's get my conkers moved up now. They've done their job here. They're doing. I'm very proud of them. Let's get this moved up. Get you into the. I think we bring a command tank in. Yeah, command tank, so we can get this point. I can probably move my command infantry up, actually, couldn't I? Oh, 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 oh. Something there we don't like. Inkler's gonna push up to here. What's the range on their weapon? Good. Short. That's an Abrams shape. May have overextended the uh, Motav Clara a bit more than I should have done. Trying to get away from the apron. It's not going to work. Or is it? It is! No! Leave them alone! A10 rocket coming in. Is that coming for me? It's via off. Bring a book in. Cut my A pieces. A10 is coming for me. Smoke, smoke, smoke. Nicely done. That's a command. We can kill that. Let's get that killed, please. You guys got across there. Conkers is looking good here. Let's push up the Igla. Let's get you moved up as well. I mean, we've won anyway on points, but uh, at least I felt like I was doing something towards the end. <coughs> we, we just pretend the opening didn't happen. How badly did I score? Oh, I pulled it back, considering I lost everything at the start. I managed to get positive. I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take that. Do we have any all map servers? Oh, there's an all maps 10v10, but it's filling up really quick. Oh, no, mine is full. Huh. 
I guess we do airport again. I'm going to switch sides though. Because I want to try the another deck that I've made. I made... A second Panzer Grenadier ATGM spam deck. Can you tell I was in a strange mood when I was building decks? I am in Eugen 37 Airport 10v10. I'll pop the invite code in again for anyone who wants to join us. We are currently on NATO, but uh, you know, as ever, you're free to be on the other team. Just minimize the stream so you're not sniping. It is filling up quickly. As always. Once the games get so full, they always fill up very quickly. Only a thousand people on this week, so the numbers are dropping again since the last patch. I mean, every, I think a lot of people, a lot of the numbers were not necessarily even multiplayer. I think a lot of it was people playing the single player Bruder Krieg. And now everyone's played Bruder Krieg a couple of times, probably, so... They're off doing something else now. I really enjoyed Bruder Creek, by the way, and if you haven't tried it, I do recommend it. It's not bad as far as uh, short single-player campaigns go. What do I think of the sixth? I think there are. I find their units very expensive, and I I really wish they had more Lustrum Jaeger and stuff because. It feels like they should, like, I want them to be an air assault deck, but they don't quite fit the bill, if you see what I mean. In my head, that's that's kind of, that would fit that niche very nicely, like, not a forward deployment deck, but a deck that could air assault from the back with helicopters. But uh, they, they just don't have enough of them to consistently do that, like... I'd used most of them in my opener, and they all died anyway, but... <clears throat> oh, burning a group here and got wrecked. There's there's no two ways about that. I think some of, the, some of the house cleaning's a bit rough. Some of the house cleaning's a bit rough. I apologise, I didn't check the names there, but hopefully none of them are inappropriate, because I just twitched the screen. <clears throat> No, I think they're all right. I think uh, since Eugen have started uh, dishing out bans, there's, uh, people are a bit, being a bit more self-controlled. I'm coming, Stal. I'm coming to assist you because I have 80 GMs out the wazoo. Just about everything I have is coming with 80 GMs. One of our team immediately sur no, one of the opponent opponent's team immediately surrenders. Oh well. Uh <clears throat> I'm gonna send some Jaeger actually. Uh I wanna try and get some Jaeger into here of all places, just to dissuade. And then we'll get one eighty GM in there, and then just to upset style, I'm going to get one into that building there. And I don't have any forward deployable AA though, so awkward. Uh, this road. And then... Strikers. Jaguars. Oh, recon, that's helpful, isn't it? Recon in there. Recon in there. Let's get an Alpha Clara down as well. I'd love to get those guys into there. And then I 
We've got some Pioneer Flams that I'm going to send into that area as well if I can. And they come in Fux Milans. I've got loads of Fux Milans. They're not going to be the help, most helpful thing. Let's put a couple of these guys down as well. Because these are Milans coming in Fuchs Milans. To get to there. Maybe I should bring some proper AA. Let's do that. Have Ihawks always been 130 points? I don't know why, but that looks really expensive. Some logistics in for that as well. Hmm. I don't know where everyone else has gone. Hopefully someone's sending something to Kilo. Because I've technically not sent anything actually into Kilo. I can. That is that is definitely doable. Oh shit. <clears throat> you know that thing that comes up that says whether you're giving orders to all your troops or not? And, you know. I just completely ignored that it even existed. Whoops. Spent all my points. I'm very proud of myself. Do we look a bit short on the ground? Uh oh. It'll be worse, actually. Most of the uh, helicopters went down. It's landed, that's a mistake. Fito should kill. Oh no, it's gone again. Where's my. I think you're supposed to be very slow. Oh, we should be absolutely fine. They've, they've managed to drop off like one squad alive, I think. So, that's good for us. Yeah, one squad arrives with Edgar. Dead. Surely. Lovely style. I'll call in a tank next, so I'm, I'm being totally helpful in that sense as well. There's going to be a lot of artillery. Milan 2 in there, Milan 2 in there. Liga Force can deploy. One in there, one over here. One in there. And these Fox Milans are going to move over there. Are you guys are going to push around this way. The Pioneer Flams. Let's get a couple of. I know where the armbus are going to be handy. They're going to be handy in here. Let's also get some recon in into here. Looking pretty good at the minute. Hey, Propaganda, how are you doing, dude? You did miss it. You can catch the next one if you're still around. Let's get the strikers pushed up and the Jaguars. Wait, have they got nothing here? Can we just can we just push this like really aggressively? I wonder if I can get into that tree line there. I'm not sure. I'm going to push my uh, snipers up that way. Because those T-80s are like begging to be shot at. We've got some nasty artillery back there. We've got stuff coming around that way. 
My infantry can push around here. We do need to make sure we keep this side covered. I'd like to bring in a Leo, just so I have a tank to play with. Bradleys and strikers everywhere. Oh, there's nothing in there. Let's roll. Let's roll. We need some more Fliege Force and we'll push these ones up. Jaguar 2s, let's go. Fuck some lands moving up, moving up, moving up, moving up. Oh, Conkers versus Strikers. Conkers versus Strikers. Conkers gonna win. No, it missed! It missed! Come on! Come on, Strikers! You're both incredibly disappointing. <laughs> Stalzak, Stiles, Stiles, I've got it. <laughs> can just get these in the Fuchs Milans and move them up quicker, can't I? That's that's the sensible thing to do. Go on, Flieger Force. Get stuck in. Where's the other Flieger Force? They're very slow. Uh-oh. That's Cluster. That's rude. My ATGM spam doesn't work against that. Hey, hey, okay. How are you doing, dude? Get the supply vehicle up here as well. I think we need. I'm gonna bring an eye hawk in. Got Flieger Force on the way. Get these Jaguars over this way. And that was my recon. Let's bring in that. The Jaeger. Got two Fuchs Milans there. Got plenty of infantry in here. I've got these guys here. The arm busts are good. They're just gonna chill. Oh, I don't want to select all of them. Let's grab those two. Just sit you in over there. You're gonna need a medic. You can push up to there. Oh, it opened fire. That's a mistake. <laughs> Something was going to hit it. A UD. I, I really need... Re oh, the Akav can see stuff. If the Akav can get eyes on, we can kill some... Uh, we can kill some tanks. That was a preemptive strike from a cluster. That's for me. Oh, I caught them both. I feel robbed. I feel robbed that it caught them both. It's doing. Those costs are doing a upsetting amount of damage to my infantry. I remember when they didn't do much to infantry. Push those guys up to there. I'm gonna leave the leave one Jaeger squad here just to cover the road. Hmm. I think we bring a Gepard in, you know. It's looking good. Thanks for the follow, dude. See, now I don't have enough ATGMs up here, do I? 
I need to keep them more spread out. Oh wow, you need to keep moving, keep moving. They don't like my eye hawk. Whoever that is does not like my eye hawk. I'm gonna like this one even less. Need more logistics. You guys need to pull back here. And get them rearmed. I think we want to bring in. What about your force here? Beware, commies nearby. Not at all. I, I like doing my uh, on a Wednesday stream, especially when I'm doing some silly decks like I am today. I'll pull out the deck uh, drafter one from the Warriors website again shortly after we've done this game. That was really funny. Stal will never forgive me, but uh, it's very funny. It's like the worst deck ever invented or ever created. Not like that car to do that. Oh. My recon arrived. Lots of Conker's vehicles. Maybe I should start bringing in the RT. I, I, I purchased the. Oh, I brought the Lars in this deck just because I want to try them. I haven't tried the Lars for a long time. Oh, I think I think my uh, yeah, I think I lost my thingy to seed. Oops. Okay, I may have overegged the pudding on. Uh, how far I can push that forward. Well, these guys are looking good here. Lovely. This is red too. Enemy spotted. Then we're going to move these guys over this one. Oh, oh. UDs pushing up. UDs are a bit of a problem. I'm not looking good for my Flieger Force. See if we can focus down this one. Okay, that one instead. They're retreating. <laughs> What are the odds? An ammo explosion. Munitions chocolate. Now my artillery... ...isn't going to do a lot to those, but... Oh wow! It's actually not got the range. Is this map that big? That's some more to spam from back there. They have impressive eyes on to see that behind a tree line. I guess that can see them? Yeah, I'm not getting anything close to the front at the minute. I am massively overextending when I don't need to, of course. Guess we've got to try and kill that thing.
Yeah, they can see everything, can't they? They really don't like my eye hawks. You can get sold. Lost all my units. Sorry, Star. I'm I'm really not taking the game very seriously tonight. Playing with these weird decks. I apologize. I was quite proud of myself in my first game. Pulling my points back. Some more of these. Bring in another eye hawk. There's some logistics. Lots and lots of tanks coming in. Watch my man can push this way. You're gonna push over to here, you're gonna get into there. Bring a couple of cheap choppers for anti tank as well. Much anti tank spam. We've actually almost won the game. I wasn't really looking at the points. I very rarely look at the points. My units here are just absolutely cleaning up. It's quite funny. Every time some reinforcements come along, my guys are ready and waiting. They just want to get back in here. We're on a plus four now. Are we having trouble at this side? I wasn't really watching. Do you reckon they have a command vehicle in there? Do you reckon we could be really cheeky and get a command in? I'm going to try. Pretty sure that person left and that's the AI. Nice kill. Now you're going to have to move again. Force, so you guys have arrived. One of you in there. One of you in there. Let's keep an eye on those choppers at that side. We do have the Fleet of Forests. So I'm not too worried. I'd love to get a supply truck in there for them. That's dead. Yeah. <laughs> it's not dodging that many ATGMs. Fleeger Force, push forward. Six truck in there. Alright, that's that chopper going down. We're okay, we're okay. You're gonna get rearmed, you're gonna get repaired. You're know, looking good. They do have that now, so they've neutralized it with 40 minutes left, but we just need to get a command in, and I reckon we're gonna get one in here, no problem. 
Oh, let's get the flame troops up this way. Should we get a command tank in here, do we think? Let's do that. I really want to go around the back way. Oh! <coughs> we finally got some attention. Run away! Come on, get a kill! These guys are fully repaired, just a bit stressed, but they can move back in there. Oh. Need to get in there. If we can get in there, we'll be sitting pretty for those extra few points to win the game. Where's that? Oh, that near pump's going for these guys. Something in mind dying or getting shot at. Oh, it's just the flames. It's just the flames in the forest. We're okay. No worries, propaganda. Have a good one, dude. I thought this was going to be over by now, the way the uh, points looked, but uh, they have managed to stabilise. Ooh. Get these here, and a couple of these guys. A couple of Feldjäger. Because they are pushing around the back here. Someone's getting shot at. Come on, kill the seed, someone. Oh, I got out. Did manage to get one of my uh, thingies again. I'm not even trying to turn them on and off in a 10v10. These guys pushed up. Flee your force, make me proud. Oh, the pioneer flies across here. That's just AI running around. Flee your force missing every shot. Marvelous. Bring in a uh, Leo 105, I think. In fact, let's bring in two just to help deal with these infantry that they're pushing across. Uh, let's get these guys over here. We can engage them with the. Uh, very nice kill on my uh, AA. And a very nice kill on my thingy as well. Okay. Means I have to bring in another one. This is why I have so many eye hawks, just so I don't have to babysit them in a 10v10 game. They have very good eyes on back here. I'm not sure from what. Even they shouldn't be able to see the fleet of force from that distance. I wouldn't have thought, because they're so small. We need some recon up here again, don't we? I just want to walk that back there. Actually, I can just do that. Then 
They're on a plus three because they've got... Oh, they've absolutely smashed that side of the map. Right. We're going to have to push in this side. Come on, side ch Ah, that smoke just in time. They're relying very, very heavily on their artillery. Let's uh, return the favour, shall we? You are... Can we stop moving? Oh, it's going to be... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Prepared the tank instead. Really curious if this does anything. I'm not imagining it's going to do much. I don't think the Lars are that good, but... Uh, yeah, no real effect, I don't think. Right. So what we're going to do is push into here, along with both of these. I just want to take this point off the AI, since we lost the other side and they're in a plus six at the moment. I've, I've not had very good teams today. Every game I've played, my team struggled. <laughs> We've won a few, but it just feels like my team has struggled. I mean, there's a lot of stuff back here, but it's all AA and artillery in that. Oh. Right. I don't think my ally here is going to come in with me. I don't even know if they're still in the game, to be honest. Everyone's still in the game, but no one's really doing very much. So I guess I'm going in solo. But my plan is... To throw them off by moving this in, the command tank. get these guys to push in here. Well, this guy's... Okay. Mac had the same idea, apparently. And I was just going to move this command into this corner. I imagine they have a command at the back, but... Yeah, they've got loads of stuff at the back of the point, look. They were ready for it, so they've artillery in the back anyway. So I need to try and protect that command. I've got them on a down to a plus three. I need to rush back here and try and deal with this mess. We're holding there, but can we push into this side is the question. They've got loads of seed coming in still. We need to take out the seed. I got point I got units on every part of the map, as usual. I wonder if I can just target that corner with my artillery and pray that we get some kills and kill the command. Because they've got T eighty UDs pushing up everywhere. Which are a problem. 
Oh, I'm gonna lose my back. You go with it. Do we lose it? I must have lost my supply. Sorry, right, I can bring another one in. There's the command look. I have no feasible way of killing that unless it gets caught out here by my artillery, which has finished firing, so the answer is no. Uh, nice idea. That's one of our guys surrendering from the middle. Right. Let's push. Gepard needs to get on that. Command tank can stay back a little bit. I just need to get back in this point, so... What are we doing over here? My friend still is sat outside the point and my command's, my command's dead in the point. And the other players aren't doing anything. I mean, he's got loads of units here, but they're just not doing anything with them. Right, get in this point. This is complete suicide of these tanks, but... Because they've got so many 80 gems in there, we've got no recon, but... We've lost this game because the team just aren't anywhere to be seen, to be honest. No way I'm going to get my command in there. Dead command tank. And of course I'm spending points elsewhere and not on my point, so... I'm going to struggle to defend this now. We do have, thankfully, Stahl here, but uh, you know, there are multiple players in front of us. Why are you still fighting? You're dead anyway. No, well played to the other team. Our te I just don't know what our team were doing. I mean, this guy just has so much stuff that's just sat not doing anything. For anyone who's watching who's new to the game, don't just sit all your units really far back. Engage, get involved, assist your teammates if they're trying to push. Otherwise, you may as well not be in the game because you've already lost. Bailed out. You're dead then. That's me getting some bad uh, bad rolls. Let's grab logistics for the artillery. Not that it's going to do us any good. I mean... Where, where, where were all these units? Ten minutes ago, they were just sat back here. When I had my two commands in that point. if we can get some damage done. They've got loads of Strathers coming in is the biggest issue right now. Uh, bring in a couple more tanks. That's the cheap.
But yeah, well played to the other team. They deserved the win. My score should be decent. Oh look, this guy finally brought a command in. Acceptable losses. I'm going to get stuff shot down, but I'm just trying to slow the progress. I mean, I've already got the point anyway. Well played to them. These little white bars, you mean? Like, on the unit symbols, or... If you mean on the unit symbols, that's the health. Or how much health they have left. So, like, that's pretty much dead. There aren't any... I was going to say, I didn't think there were any white bars on the actual unit cards. I'd better be positive in that game. Considering I was everywhere on the map trying to destroy stuff. I bet I'm not. Oh, I am. 5,000 to 3... 5,000 to 4,000, pretty much. Yeah, our team was absolute garbage. <laughs> absolute garbage. Well played to the other team. We got a server which is going to be a different map, please. Uh... Can't face the same map again. Might just have to pick a server and try and fill it, I think. I'm, just, I'm leaving this server because I want to find one on a different map. Let's go for... Let's try and make one fill up. Eugen 32, Crown 10v10. Anyone who wants to join. And this time, I'm going to upset Stal even more by playing my 11th deck. So, this... This was made with the War Yes deck drafter. It is an absolutely terrible deck. Um, I will... Hang on, let me put my screen on a second so you can have a look. So this is what the deck drafter gave me. I get no tanks, even though this is a tank-heavy deck. I've got no tanks, pretty much. It gave me it get every single op. It gives you three choices, and you have to choose one of the three. And as you can see, the majority of my choices were recon. Are you impressed, Stell? Are you impressed? Do you want to know the funny thing? I played this earlier in a ten v ten that I recorded, and I will put up next week, along with me building the deck. It's uh, Ugen thirty two, I believe. The, the uh, invite code is what I posted previously, Mighty. But I surprisingly did amazingly well with this deck. I was the second best on the team. Uh, the team lost, incidentally, but I was very proud of myself, considering I had not pretty much booger all in terms of tanks. But I held, and I held, and I held. It was good fun. Uh, when it comes to playing multiplayer, my advice is just give it a go and play some 10v10s. Most people don't play the game very well. Whether they're single player or multiplayer, they don't play the game that well. And that's not me being rude. It's just people don't put the hours in all the time in required to play really well. And that's normal, right? Not a lot of people do that. And then you get some people who just play a lot, but don't ever really improve massively, I guess. Just because it's not their thing. This will take a short while to fill up, by the way. 
just because uh, there's a couple of servers above us. <laughs> oh, when it comes to 10v10s, um, you kind of have to accept that people are going to play bad. You know, it's it's different if you're really bad and you join a two v two. Yes, mighty, that is currently my name. I changed my name to random shit. I haven't actually changed it in a few weeks now, if not like two months, which is unusual. I need to change it again. Yeah. 10v10s can be an, an artillery spam fest. If you're if you're a, not a good player and you join a 2v2, then you know people might get upset with you, unless it's like a noob game. But joining a 10v10, it's where I would tell all new players to start in multiplayer and minimize, make the chat as small as possible. You can't hide it, but People will talk shit to people sometimes in the game. Most people are pretty polite. Like even if they, even if I have a complaint on stream, generally I'm pretty accepting of new people anyway. But I, you know, I'm on stream, so I'll have a complaint. But uh, no, everyone starts somewhere, and 10v10s are just a, a really good place to start and learn the game and just. You know, get an idea of how other people play in multiplayer. Obviously, smaller team games and 1v1s are very different. You know, you will not approach a 10v10 the same way you would approach a 1v1 ranked match. No one wants to join our game. I suppose we could switch to one of the tactical ones. It's because other games keep opening up above us. So it keeps shifting. We'll give it another couple of minutes. Crown used to be a really popular map for 10v10. It's it's one of the biggest maps. Maybe that's why people don't like it. Because you're kind of on your own in a lane. Where in like Darkstream and things like that. There's a lot of you piling into one area. So there's less stress on you. I think that's... In fact, that's another good bit of advice. If you are new to multiplayer and new 10v10 join the smaller maps like dark stream like airport to some extent um rocks maybe these are smaller maps where and triple strike probably as well they're smaller maps where you you've got other people with you at your point whereas on some of the bigger maps there's a lot more happening and you kind of have to hold your own yeah let's let's change to ugen 33 dark stream everyone just because this one's not filling i'll still be on nato i'll stick the invite code in again dark stream isn't a bad map That traitor Manko's on the wrong team now. It's okay, Manko. Just 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 minimize the stream. <laughs> you know the drill, I'm sure.
You might get lucky. Someone might leave. Mandos. Now there's a traitor. Look at him. Sneaking in the last second on the wrong team. That's just typical Mandos there. Hello if you're there, Mandos watching. Sorry for the wait, everyone. Back in. All right, so. Yeah, there he is, Mandos. Yeah. Troublemaker. Uh, no one has an offensive name that I can see. Fine. Uh, I'm looking for Stal. Stal, Stal, can I can I come and assist you? <laughs> I'm so sorry in advance, Stal. <laughs> this is where Stal moves his marker. <laughs> We, we might need some support at this side. Bring us there, taxi. <laughs> I'm sorry, Stal. Yes, sir. Look. We'll deploy at this position. It'll be fine, Stal. It'll be fine. Okay. Look, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring some anti-air choppers to get us started, to just to help defend that front line. They're probably going to die. Look at my recon tab. It's awesome. It's it's the best recon tab I've ever had. I mean, it's wonderful. Play those guys over there. I've still got some flash look. I'm going to flash in. Try and get those guys into there if we can. Uh, I've got some dra I've got the Marders. We bring the Marders. Let's do that. I don't really have much AA either. This is such, this is such a bad deck. I'm gonna bring. I bring it. I bring a command tank, yeah. My staff and myself are ready, sir. It's gonna be absolutely fine, style. Look, wait. Did you leave, style? Style left. I'm just gonna make that small. We must be missing a player or two. Style actually move. He hasn't put any units there. And I could probably put, like, a command in Charlie and just try and hold the corner of it, but... I'm gonna, it's going to be a challenge to uh, hold it properly. I'll send the command there. A little Eltis there. Just to cap it. And, uh... I'll get an LRS... Oh, shit. Oh, well. No, I won't get an LRS in there. Uh, I'm gonna BGS in here. You can just hold it for now. It's better than nothing. Well, this is a hard push. Look at this, Rangers, Dragon, and stuff. Where they're going to? He's not pushing very far. I thought he was going to push, like, up to here. Incoming. BMP2. Rosvedka BMP2. Get you up there. You can engage that. Igla's dropping off back there. Tungiska dropping off back there. Nice kill. Nice to play over there. Oh, artillery incoming. Yes, 
Shit. That's a lot of BMPs with missiles. But we're across. I don't have any long range ATGMs, so other than. I've got some helicopters. Let's push the ACAV up. Not too bad here, is it? And we're in control here, so that's probably good. I want to bring in. Maybe if I just bring in a Marta Milan and a Stinger. I don't have much AA in this weird deck. What have we learned? Don't trust the deck drafter. A lot of stuff over there. We're doing okay. Let's get these Milans pushed up. Uh, we're not, probably not going to fare too well versus the BMP3s, but it's uh, okay. I want to get some more infantry in here if I can. Uh, dismount troopers sounds good. I just need something with anti-tank capability. I just don't have the range on those. Push the LRS up to there. Oh, help if I manage to click them. Plans are going to do is push that way. Need a way to deal with those. I'm thinking Sea Knights. Or we bring in aircraft. They do have AA knocking about. Uh, bring a green archer in sitting there. Looking okay there. You've arrived. You're arriving. I'm just trying to keep a hold on this point. Sprut there. I want some artillery in maybe. That I can do. Oh. Not the best artillery, but... I can be supportive. Such a funny duck. Oh, to conquers. I don't think they've got enough AA far enough forward to really threaten us here, so I'm going to bring in. I'm going to bring in a tow cobra. Yeah, I have a weird... I have, like, some tow cobra. I have some that are, like, rank 1, or, vet, like, rookie, and then some that are rank, ranked up to veteran. It's very weird. I'm going to push through here. to get into this area and then we can probably move our tank up. And I can probably bring in my other piece of RT as well. Get on control group one. I've got a jet knocking around there. AA chopper. Is that going to engage? No, it, was, it wasn't quite in range. There's a tour there, so that can be artillery. Let's do that. I'll bring in my other piece of artillery actually. Let's... Let's wait before we fire, because if I start firing, that's it done. But you guys push up to here. You follow the dis... No. I kind of wanted to follow the dismount troopers rather than... Let's just move them there instead. So they finally got a command in here, unsurprisingly. Well, that's alright. I'm not too bothered about that. I'm just going to try and make sure we can hold this side. Push these up to assist the Bradleys. Yeah, 
We're looking pretty good there. We're on a plus one, which is nice. Even better if we can stay that way. Can't see anything back there at the moment. What we're going to do is move this green archer up to there. There we go, we finally found some infantry. That's what I was waiting for. So they know we're here. So we just go straight for the next point. Push this guy up as well. You guys push up, you guys push up. Let's bring in a couple more of you. Over here is Okie Dokie. Let's have some fun, shall we? Kill the supplies. Are they moving the supplies? No. They tried to kill my infantry. How rude. Oh, there's quite a lot of shit in here. Okay. You kill that. The artillery will be coming any second. So I need to get a move on to the other side of this forest. Fight at you. You just back off. There's the artillery, see? Told you it would be coming in. Let's get some logistics in. That was better than I thought it was going to be. We didn't lose too many of the infantry. I can bring in some dragons. There we go. That'll be helpful. How's my artillery looking? Because I didn't move it. It's alive. It's Tel Cobra pushed up. That actually didn't go too badly. Get this guy around here and try and kill that BMP3. Let's get some more logistics in. I've got this nice supply here which I can drop at the back. Just bring in a little recon chopper just for this side. I'm just worried in case that snuck something around the back. Let's kill that BTR command because I can. Interesting. Why don't I just move those around this way? Works for me. Where are these guys going? Got a very expensive Bradley. Am I artillery hitting anything? Not really. So it's a Conkers, weirdly. I don't know what I expected that to be. It wasn't Conkers. Right then. You guys try and push up to there. You guys unload. Dragons push up to there as well. 
The supplies come here. You get up there. I have his repaired. Let's get that moved up. We're still on a plus two. Bad things happening? Yeah, bad things at the other side of the map. We might have to get over there and help. I mean, I could do it with. I'm going to bring the mortars in. It's not really what I want. You need to move. Nice try, Tunguska. See, very rude people saying, how's your shitty push going on the left? I mean, oh, how's your complete failure going on the right? I mean, it's a kind of a stupid question to ask, isn't it? Did, did it count a battery, me? Naughty. Enemy is three o'clock high. Do we help them at this side since they're incompetent? Well, that guy obviously is anyway. Maybe. Let me think about it. Guys, yeah, they're telling me where I was. That's fine. Try and hit that tor again. I'm just not going to kill it, probably. These mortars are going to move into here just because it'll be harder to know where I am. So we better do something about this mess. They're going to have lots of ATGMs here is the biggest issue. We need to kill the Tunguskas. Poor Mandos. Mandos is over here. He's a good player. Rather impressive. You're somehow able to see my uh, my stuff that's in there. Hmm? I mean, just taking random pot shots at my stuff. Awfully lucky shots on my supplies, incidentally. I don't keep moving these, they really don't like them. Need some extra firepower. <laughs> I'm gonna fire those mortars at that and kill it. This is still okay. How are we doing at this side? These guys in. Let's get... I mean, one of the things I'm missing over here is recon, so let's get a green archer in. Let's get a BGS in here. This guy's moved in. It's Manko and Mandos over here. I'm so sorry, guys, but they, they're, they're not doing very well, so I thought I better come help. Good side swipe, I guess. I'm gonna bring in a pivot then. Uh, these guys can move in here. Target neutralized. 
I'm gonna move these guys a bit. Looking okay there. Over at this side. My infantry died, but everything else survived. That's okay. They got a lot of tanks in here. Is the issue. Supported by plenty of air. Or anti-air, I should say. AA back there. I'm just going to mark it. All there. This is looking okay. Let's try and push these guys up. Get the Marta pushed up as well. There's the command at the back. Look, I'm going to artillery that. At least we'll take that point off them. I don't have any long range ATGMs to deal with that. With this silly deck that the deck builder gave me. And there's a lot of T80s in there as well. I can use the F-16 anti-tanks, but I need to know there's no AA there. That guy is still insulting us all, even though it's his side that's collapsed. There we go. Thing's dead. So... Oh. We need some AA over here then. I still have my other ACAV, so I'll bring that in. Let's mortar that sprut out into oblivion. You're looking good. Do, 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 do. Not looking too bad there. Sprut should die by either my mortars or that artillery coming in. I reckon we can now move the ACA over this way and maybe push this point. Let's bring in the Tow Cobra. Bring in the Quick Fix and a couple of normal Cobras. Oops. Something I said. <laughs> Come on, my lands, get a kill. Come on, yes. Well done, martyrs. Come on, and the other one. Make me proud. Ah, you both missed. I don't think they like my mortars. Bit of a waste of jets on their part, though. So many T-80s. T-64 there, that's artillery that. We got this across. Ooh. I see some spruts to kill. Problem is the sheer amount of artillery, and unfortunately, I don't have tanks to push effectively with. So my deck is not going to work. Oh, they moved the tank! Damn it! Ready, 
Just gonna move these again. Artillery wasn't for me. They really want in this. Ready to engage. Really want in this area. Sure, these will be much help in this situation. I'm going to try and get right into this corner. Yeah, they've, they've thought better of that idea. <laughs> Not bad, okay. Okay, back off, back off, back off. Job done. Scared them off. We've got this point. Still can't really see anything in that. Mm. I'd like to get all these supply vehicles back over there. Then we need to see if we can push over this way and get into this point. I've got a couple of strellas there. I think we... Oh, you're running out of fuel. Okay. Let's get a supply chopper in for them. I'm going to attack that tor, or even Strella. Got repairs there, no idea. Went straight for my poor command tank. Do they not realise I only have two of those? in there. Tunguska there. Is it... Look at this. His weapons are on. Seed should kill that Tunguska, no problem. This is why I put seed in this deck. Or I selected the seed. Because I was like, well... Surely... It's going to come in handy. That's going for my ACAV, isn't it? Yeah. Got the Tunguska, good stuff. Right. So now how much AA they're going to have in the middle here. So my plan is to push this side where they definitely had AA. the tanks. Uh, 
And then all of this will go down the middle here. There will be a lot of jets coming in for this. I'll tour that. That's what I was looking for. Artillery What's the range on you? Pretty good, actually. Nice. Let's keep going. Is my artillery coming in on that thing? Yes, it is. But yeah, a lack of tanks in this deck is a big problem. So much artillery on the other side as well. The tanks just got artillery to oblivion. Quick fix helping. Quick fix is helping. Here comes the Ajets. I don't know, all things considered, considering I was playing with a terrible deck, I don't think I've done too badly. I think my score will be okay. Yeah, I was positive. I'm happy with that, considering that was a deck drafted deck. I'll take that. I'll take that. Yeah, well played at the other side of the map. The guy over there was terrible. He was just spent most of the game complaining about the team. Yes, we stay here for another game. I will change my deck though. Let's play a proper deck this time, shall we? Five in second. Oh, I need to update that actually. 24th, 24th we could do. Let's do 24th. Let's do 24th. Oh, you were too slow. Mando's changed. Wait, you're on the right team. Manco, you're on our team. Yeah. It's good to say. Now we have some downtime while we wait for this debriefing to end. So who's planning to watch the uh, Fallout TV series?
I guess it releases tonight for some of the USA, but it's early hours of the morning for the UK, so I won't be watching it till tomorrow. Oh, we almost started. There is a space in new gen 33 dark stream. Nope, there isn't any more. <laughs> Charlie's aren't bad. But yes, the uh I'm I'm still not a big fan of all the tank changes either, but Say la vie. It is what it is at the end of the day, I guess. No worries, man. Don't have a good night, man. Thank you for joining in. Always nice to see you knocking about. I'll come and help you again, Stal. I'll be more useful this time, I promise. <laughs> Looking for enemy planes. Bring us there, taxi. Stal's just thinking. You can sod off. War Daddy to Red Leader. I'm listening. We'll deploy at this position. Uh Da, 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 da. NG fight team, Bradley, and the LF. Yeah. Tank ready. I don't want to send too much this way this time, so I'm going to send these guys. I'm going to send a stinger. I'm going to send some cheap infantry. Mm. Those ones. So these guys, I'm going to try and get, I'm going to fast move them to here, then get them to drive there, and then get them to drive there. Okay. And then I'm going to send tanks to this, or some better units to this side. So, we'll pull a shappy down, and we'll try and do a harder push at this side, shall we? couple of those and Prophet Bradley and an Ito no Stinger what are your orders, sir? just fast move these guys over this way with the intention of pushing in there if we can Smattering at this side to hold everything else into this side. We've got people going in here. The only place we... Oh, well, there's people putting stuff near here, so I assume we're going to be okay. Oh, no, Mandos. No. I was at the other side of the map. I just sent a couple of units to try and help the poor people over there, but the guy who was over there was just complaining, or the guy next to that point was just complaining about everybody in the entire game. So I wasn't very enthused to assist. Need a ride? Hence, I sent like three units there. Oh, 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 oh. That's some forward deployment stuff. Hello. Sniper's not going to fare very well in that one. This is red two. Enemy spotted. Yes, sir. Get out now. Shut up and listen to the chief. 
We've got an 85mm cannon over there. Deploy, deploy, deploy. Need to kill that thing. Yes, sir. Open fire. Come on, cannons. I'll fire at that. Job, Lovely. At Get over here then. Good job, These guys got hit by artillery. That's alright. Get across here. Back up. Back up. Lots of damage being done there by the flames, sadly. Well, that severely fucked us. Yes, sir. Oh wow, that actually hit the bridge. I'm I'm impressed by that. Just deploy where you are, and never mind you died anyway. I'm impressed by that artillery. But we're, we're doing okay at the other side. Does this mean we're stuck on the bridge, though? I don't have any... Oh, shit! I knew I'd forgotten to change something in this deck. I don't have any fucking logistics in it. I knew there was something. Well defended at that side by them. Lots of artillery. So we need to make this work, basically. So I'm going to assist here because that other side, we're going to, we're not going to be able to push now, but we can push here. So let's assist over here. We lost way too much to push this side, so it's not worth trying. That was very good by them. Hey, Dank, how you doing, man? Yeah, I haven't seen you in a while. You, you okay? Oh, it's nice to see you. Yeah, my yeah, tank and everything, everything is dead over there, so screw it. I'm more interested in pushing in here now. We're on a plus two. Uh, these guys, not doing too badly at this side. They got kind of bogged down. I'm going to bring in some artillery, I think, to try and assist here. I do have a variety of artillery. A little bit concerned about this guy, actually, as well. Jelly Jugs is in trouble beside us. Shit. Hang on. Redirect. Redirect everything. Fuck's sakes. Fuck's sakes. Uh, I'm hoping they'll be okay, but we need to deal with this mess. These guys are okay. They will at least take to the river. These guys are pushing around well there. These guys are progressing. I would have liked to back them up, but it's not going to happen. I will try and provide artillery support, though. Speaking of, let's bring in the other one of those. Oh, fair enough, man. I'm glad you're well, though. I kind of want to hold this tree line. But he's got a command back in there, that's the main thing. Uh, let's bring in Dragon here. Do we have any recon? Oh, I've got recon on the way, that's okay. 
Okay, I've come and deploy in there. Got my tank over here. You guys come along as well. And here, so I've got a T-80 sitting there. That's going to get strike eagled. Got artillery here. These guys are do doing well. Let's. Where can we support with some artillery here? I'm going to hit this there. Clear that out. After you fire, just move forward. Are you on a control group? No, you're not. No, you're not. Deploy, deploy, deploy. Shit. I lost my it. My recon died. I didn't even see what killed them. Drill it in there, that needs to die. Ready to pound them, sir. My artillery is going in on that building now. Let's move these straight away. I'm going to move them this direction. We'll provide some fire support against this T-80. Cluster coming in on that, lovely. That should be a nice. Oh, that might have actually been nowhere near it. Yeah, never mind. Yo. Wow. They weren't looking very good. Artillery there. You come and deploy here. Scout get into there. A little bit concerned about the amount of stuff starting to come in that side. I'm once again spread all over the place. <laughs> oh, that's a command tank. Hello. What are your orders, sir? Fire and well, that is interesting. So there's a command tank in the middle of that. Yes, sir. Going you guys keep pushing this way. Got a chaparral over here. Let's get come off flash. Let's get a military police in. Everybody, check your ammo. Fire and maneuver. I was hoping they were going to stay put, but they might not. Command tank is nearly dead. Let's push. Let's just push. Screw it. Let's get this guy around here. Got the leopards coming in from Stahl. Thank you, Stahl. Oh, here we go. Good job I called in some more reinforcements here, wasn't it? Meta squads. Let's go, 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 go. Come on, fire teams. You might as well get stuck in as well. This I'm not liking the look of. Ah, 
Ah, oh, fuck's sakes. Yeah, they're just destroying all my units as they come in. I wasn't watching. This is the problem. Losing units just as they come in. Yeah, we're outnumbered here. God, that's expensive now. 220. That's exactly what I'm bringing in, though, to deal with this mess. Those units are dead anyway. See, when you then when you end up in multiple places on a map, you no longer have the forces you need to stop a push where you are, um, which is obviously a big problem. But uh, there's very little I can do at that side at the minute, uh, guys. If I mean, if you can help that, then please do. Otherwise, you're going to lose the side of that point. Do you have a target, Captain? I'm gonna pinch some supply. I hope this person doesn't mind. Really gotta stop them getting into this point. They have a lot of shit going into this point. Dear God, look at it all. Do I have mortars? No, I don't. Good ready, sir. Just get me out of here. Start flattening these buildings. I'm spread thin everywhere trying to cover stuff. Good job, Gunner. Which is Rise. not good. Head down. I hear you loud and clear. Some of this Abrams here, which I'm gonna try and assist with. Yes, Captain. Manco's coming in with more here. We're going to unload a position. There's the artillery coming in. Back up! Back up! Going there. Artillery at your orders. I think artillery is going to be our best bet for dealing with this as well. Careful! Enemies nearby! There's not a lot I can do for this side. Yeah, they've got they've got loads of shit in here as well now, so. That side's gone. At your orders, oh, I hate getting split between points. So this is what happens. Ready to Let's hit there. What's that one doing in terms of its reload? Still going. You guys are going to hit here. It's not really exciting stuff. It's lots of cheap stuff, but there's enough of it. And then it's the artillery spam. I don't even feel like I can operate the uh, 
strike eagles. I'll try and get this over here. I lost my tank that was there, obviously. You try and get over this side. We're going to be lucky to hold that. Get back in here, though, I think. Well, you, if this person doesn't mind, I'm going to pinch some supply. That's going to come and sit in there. Ready. Need to kill that. So there's a guy a bomber going for the Strella. Guess if we save him enough points, we can maybe push some tanks across the middle here. Enemy at three o'clock high. Roger, search and destroy. Try and drive this back here so it gets rearmed. Really need to change this deck and put some supply in it. And artillery that back corner because I'm assuming that's where the command is. You guys push over there. In fact, you guys can. Can you quick hunt to here as well? We need to get back across this bridge. We've lost the command in there. Have, oh, it's badly damaged. It's there. Come on. Die BMP3. Nah, they're missing. I'm going to push these tanks across. I need to babysit them, really, but... There is just not enough time. Do -do -do -do. Damn, that was close. Too close. They just met us. Go back. Slow. They did a lot of damage to that tank. Uh, Ready to fire. You need to move. Good job, oh, dang. Thank you for resubscribing, dude. Pet, Much appreciated. Need to get across here. Cheapest shit we have. Loads of it. Mass spam to get across there. Need to take that point. Chaparral. Uh, oh wait. Yes, Captain. I need to just. In fact, you know what I could do here. I'm just going to smoke it. If I can get across there with it smoked, then 
that'll do. At least then I can get across and start doing some damage. But I feel like this is the only areas we can really be sure we're going to push. I don't have any mortars in this deck. There we go. Unload over here. I'm expecting to get artillery to oblivion as soon as I do this. I will say that. They're smoking as well, look. Which makes me wonder if they're going to do exactly the same thing I am. Yeah, they are. Yeah, artillery immediately, as soon as I saw what I was doing. Yeah. No chance, there's too much stuff over there. Absolutely no chance. No chance. It was a nice idea, but... Uh, not successful. I'd love to push across here, but I'm not sure how. I guess we try the same again. Really, I didn't didn't quite click with me that those reservists and had rocket launchers. I always just think of them as the same as the other reservist squads that generally don't have rocket launchers. here again. Problem is the amount of artillery in play makes it very difficult to be like, oh, I'm going to push. Because as soon as you push somewhere, you get artillery. We need to try and get in here, though. Military police are routed, never mind anything else. Oh. Oh. Yeah, there's no way we're getting across that. There's too much stuff. Sorry, your Wi Fi is not doing very well. 
Well, thanks for stopping by anyway, and thank you for uh, the resub, dude. Kind of at a loss with this game. Maybe push this bit, I guess, is the only other choice. But I'm just conscious of the fact that as soon as I push across here, we're going to get artilleried a lot. to that to try and reload you. You were reloaded. She's good. They wouldn't really push across. I think. Are they going to try and push across the bridge here? That's really weird. I'd just kind of hold that side now. Maybe that's just me. He's there. Strike Eagle's coming out. Because I want help with these tanks. This isn't happening. If we get into this corner and kill the command, that would be great. Bradley hit each other. I think that just vanished suddenly. That was weird. Ito's gonna die. Very lucky item. Good effort. They've got evac, evac, evac. Oh my god! Oh my god! Bad strike, eagle. Bad. And bad on me for not paying attention to the fact that it was coming back in. Gonna artillery there. I don't know what uh, it's a be. Oh, it's a command. It's a command vehicle. Go, 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 go. Dead. Nice. There's another command in now. Maybe. Looks like it. I don't think they've got anything in here anymore. You know. I need some anti-air up here. That ACAV needs to be over here now. That's a command tank. You guys back off. Let's get the MLRS firing at that. We lose a command there. We did. 
Okay. Weirdly. Hey, Protoss. How are you doing, man? Good stream? Welcome Raiders, you catch us in a rather rough game with many T-80s. And me with a deck where I've forgotten to put uh, Ready for trophy hunting. supply in, which obviously is very bad. supply of people. Oh, are you completely out of... Oh. They're out of fuel. Never mind. Command tank is on the way. A couple more of these in. I was over here at the start of the game. Then I ended up over here as well. And then I ended up in the middle. And now I'm over here. <laughs> Enemy at three high. I'm playing firefighter. Yes, move, move, move. At your We're looking. You're not. You are resupplied. Move over there. Command's dead in here, so at least that'll take us back a bit. Oh wow, Res managed to get a tank all the way in here. It's, oh, never mind. I was impressed because it's been a nightmare trying to get back into this point. It's artillery, a lot of it. Move and get artillery. Welcome to 10v10. Could be worse. Where do we reckon the command is here? I'm going to artillery the bushes at the back. That's neutralized us again. 25 minutes left. Oh, that's not good. assist with a helicopter. The Cobras are operating okay here, so just need to stop them pushing across. Cooler there. Chaparral should be able to deal with that. Unload, unload, unload. I said unload. God damn it. Wow. Well, that was shit. Stingers. Chaparral's aren't what they used to be. Trailers are in position now. Enemy at three o'clock high. Mm, don't like the fact they got across that.
got a command in at this side. I lost my recon. Oh, there's the command, look. Hello. This is how you suicide a strike eagle. Just need to slow down the points again. The artillery is never going to stop coming, so I just have to accept that I'm going to lose units. Come on, strike eagle. Come on. It's our point again. Firefighting. Lots of firefighting. Hmm. Well, then the back in again. Where do we reckon? Right in the corner or not? Yes, Captain. Fast I'm trying to get my sniper around there so I can see. Pushed across. Nice bombing strikes. Go on. Strike eagles on route. Just give me a target. He sighted at twelve o'clock. Ryan, get down. Bomber ready. Enemy at three o'clock. High. Oh, wow. Nice kill from the MiG-29s. Sleepy Joe. Good player. Wasn't expecting a wall of MiG-29s of that. Just need to find this command. Turn my sniper's weapons off. Technically should stay invisible here. No, apparently he is visible. Really? I tell you what, if that was me, I would never see that. Pretty sure he was still in cover. Well, without being able to push there and get across here, it's got to be this side, hasn't it? There's going to be no easy way to do it. The artillery is not to stop me. Uh, I want you on control group 2 and I want you on control group 3. I guess we just charge forward with what we have 
I hope we can find it. Tank destroyer ready. Be sighted at 12 o'clock. Don't think there's anything else we can do, to be honest. If the enemy is in range, so are we. Because we'll be able to hold the points we have, but without retaking that or taking that side point, which unfortunately we have I'm not able to. We have to take this. This is red two. Enemy spotted. All right, jelly jugs, I'm coming. Everything's needed dead anyway, so screw it. Let's go. There it is in the corner. Yeah, come on, Stingers. Make me proud. I'll miss everything. That too. Well, they didn't do too badly, the Stingers. Question is, will my artillery hit the mark? Probably not is the answer. This is just lambs to the slaughter, by the way. Just to try and stop them and slow them down. on you see I don't have any recon they've had good recon the entire game to be honest this guy credit where credit is due right, we've neutralized it again but we're not doing very well anywhere else to be honest I've lost this bit again to the T-80s. And this is the thing, once the T-80 spam starts rolling towards the end of the game, it's very difficult to deal with. Pact is just so strong with the T-80s, still. The T-80 BVs, the U's, the UDs are just so strong. When you can mass them in a 10v10. I think... The tank changes are made where they nerfed all of the other tank, like loads of the tanks, and reduced their armor from 20 was a huge mistake. I think it's realism be damned, you unbalanced the game. And it might work in 1v1, but once you start getting into big team games, it's just such a. Dealing with a horde of T-80 BVs is not fun. I'm like sat here with points, but I'm honestly not sure where to spend them. I guess we could try and get across here again. Then back on a plus one. 
think we bring my other auxiliary in. Sure, will hold the flank has turned off their supply, so they're not sharing. Which is a shame. But, uh, well, there you go. When when we realise we've lost the game, because we can't artillery stuff. There you go. Try and kill that command. Everyone's firing at it. You're routed. These guys have got encircled somehow. I don't know how. Mostly with T-80s by the looks of it. They've got encircled there. How do these people have so many points to spend? I think they're just saving up masses and masses and then sending stuff in. And bringing in AA to assist. This should go okay for us. Just by sheer numbers of AA that are brought in. I mean, this is like early game stuff that's being brought in here. I'm very confused. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff to throw away suddenly. Okay, good for us. Good shout on the uh, request for assistance there, Manko. Very good shout. Well, that's annoying. Do you have a target, Captain? Adjusting one target. More T eighty BVs. I wonder if they're finally running out of stuff. We could get across the bridge there, it would help. Oh, we've lost that side completely now. I think this game is done. Been a rough old game though. Had some really rough games tonight, to be honest. I know I've been playing silly decks for most of the night, but this one wasn't a silly deck. This was a sensible deck, sort of. Another one bites the dust. Done artillery. Oh, there we go. He turned it on to reload his own stuff. Yes, Captain. Enemy spotted. Gun ready. That's helpful. Ten degrees up. Fire. Oh. Fire Someone reloaded one of these. Thank you. That's right, can't. I may have done it by accident, but I appreciate it nonetheless. I'm trying to artillery this corner. Uh, At your orders, Captain. I keep sharp. So Any that's target? an. I'm assuming that's a command. Yeah. This guy keeps eyes on it. I'll try and kill it. No, I lost eyes on. Strike Eagle. Always the risk. Do 
Always the risk. Let's try and kill that and then you are going to try and kill this and then as a last ditch attempt we'll try and get across this main bridge but I don't think it's going to work. Another suicide run, most likely, but... Nice kill, okay. We got what we wanted. You guys... Target... That. Artillery at your orders. You try and resupply again there if you'll let us. Probably if he turns it on again at some point. Are you, you guys are going to come and deploy over here. Books over here. They're still on a plus one because they control the other side of the map. This is red two. Enemy spotted. What are your orders, sir? Pull this way, pull this way, pull this way. Let's get behind the trees. BV Die, which I kind of expected. Get the tow cobra over to assist. I mean, it's all in at this point, isn't it? Let's just fucking go for it. They're already ahead. There's five minutes left. We've got a command going in that corner. Plenty of AA around. There's the command tank. Where do you need us, sir? Right. I'm just going to send all of my tow cobras on it, even if they die. Come on. Oh, if you fire at that, fire at that, fire at that. Nah, panicked. Worth a try. Good ready, sir. The captain and his crew welcome you aboard. Suicide mission. Another brutal game. Yeah, rough night for games tonight. I do feel like playing on NATO is now the really, really hard side to play on again. It's so much nicer playing on uh, 
so much nicer playing on packed. Just so many T80s and they're just a wall that is unstoppable. Huzzah! Oh no, they're right in the corner. Let him make that very smart. This isn't loop, this is uh dark stream. And it's not a ship map for NATO. Every map is a ship map for NATO if you've got a team that knows remotely what they're doing with T80 BV spam capability. It is really strong. What happened to all my AA over here? Yeah, they're all just dying on the bridge now. So there's a huge problem in this game, which I hadn't noticed till recently, which is that if loads of vehicles die on the bridge, it blocks the bridge permanently. It's game breaking. So this bridge here is perma blocked because of the amount of wrecks that are on it. See this? Fact. I'm print screening that to, to put it on the uh, strike team to show you, Jen, because this is a massive problem. It is, if you've only got one or two bridges that you need to get across to fight something, and that's happened, that's it. The game's over. You cannot cross the bridge. It's really weird. And get another kill on command. Beware. Oh dear. But yeah, well played to the other team. We'll play pack next week so we can abuse the T80 BVs. In fact, I tell, well, no, I probably will stream for just less time next week. Because I'm going away on holiday the next day, so. Did I even break even there? Oh, hell no, I didn't. Didn't think so. That was a terrible game. Well, they did roll us at the end, Manco. With the, once they had the massive T-80s, that's, that's them rolling us at the end. And the only reason they didn't roll us properly was because the river was in the way. If that had been a normal map, they would have rolled us. Well-organized team with lots of T80 BVs. Well played to them. But thank you for joining me, everyone. I hope you all have a very nice evening. Enjoy the rest of your week. Hopefully we get an interesting dev blog tomorrow. I have no idea what it'll be about. Your guess is as good as mine. Is our friend Vulcan streaming today? Hmm.
Vulcan is not streaming today. Is Vulcan away? I was going to send you over to Vulcan, but I can't do it. Oh well. <laughs> 